Hey, what's up, guys and gals? Can you smell that? Can you smell the potatoes and the bacon? And oh my goodness, that is so awesome. Thank you for joining me, guys and gals. Let's continue playing Prison Architect. I'm having so much fun here building my prison. And let's just do a quick review of what we have here. So we have a common room that's available to all the prisoners that they can go in and, you know, uh, relax for a little bit and not get too uh, violent. Visitation over here, of course. The place where they come and talk to their family and friends and uncles and Billy Bob and all that stuff. We have all of our cells down here. And that is fantastic. We have a little bit of a blinking light there. Uh, whew, what is that? Okay, so this light, we can dismantle it because it's in the wall. And so that's not going to work. We have a small yard over here, of course. Shower, intake room, and offices. The offices have not been... Uh, powered up yet so let's keep that in mind we have our gardeners doing their work and let's keep going so do we have any grants that are active we have one prison acclimation engagement basically this has to do with their work so we have to make sure that they are working and working correctly and working hard so we got to set that for them however we need logistics and we need prison late, which is prison labor. It's the same thing. So the logistics, well, sorry, in order to get the logistics, you need prison labor. And so we have about two minutes to go. So we're almost there. Let's look back over here. Uh, 50 cells, we're not gonna do that. Staff well-being, build a staff room, five guards. Let's do that. Th this should be fairly easy. So what we need to do here is have five guards without assigned duties. Let me check something, guys and gals. Let me just check something very quickly. The audio, is it loud enough? Okay, there we go. Okay, I just want to make sure it could be heard. Now, this is becoming a little bit cramped, you have to admit, guys and gals. So, I'm thinking this might be a good place for a kitchen, just like up here. We do have money, um, so that's not going to be our problems. And then this we could always designate as something else. So, let me go ahead and do that. I'm just gonna go a little ways up here. And I think the thing to do is just make a large canteen, just like that. And in fact, we can surround it with the kitchen here. And so what that's gonna do, it's gonna allow us just to billow out as much as possible. So I am gonna need an extension of our fence. So let me do that first. We're gonna do that just like so. And then we're gonna add a staff door. If you guys and gals like the series, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more. I really like to see your interactions on this. It's really cool. It makes everything really fun. And so, yeah, it's going to be great. It's going to be great. We're having so much fun here. Okay, let's continue with the staff room. Why don't we build a staff room right over here? And so the way we're going to do that is go too wide. And then we don't need a huge staff room, though. I'm going to do that. So what that's going to do, guys and gals, is do hallway, hallway, and then room. And we might split it in half or do something else. I don't know. We might do something like a curved small room and then a larger room. So we'll see. I don't know, like I said, what I'm going to do, but we'll, we'll make use of as much of the room as we can. And then, of course, we can extend the common room, and it can keep going and going and going and going and going. All right. So you see them already joining up building the outer fence, in which case we will delete this and make the canteen. Now this canteen might not look huge, and it's not, but remember, we could expand it. And that's a thing. The problem with this one is no expanse space. And we'll redesignate the room to something else. It'll be a different type of room for us. Okay, look at that. Perfect. Now, didn't we put a door there? I thought I put a door. I did. Okay, so... Hopefully they'll add that door right there. Prisoners are in the yard, look at that. This is wholesome. Now hopefully they don't start arguing or fighting. You have Corpse Circus, Yellow Skull, that's his name, the Killator. That is crazy, he's gonna serve 55 years total, already served 10. Remember, all these guys could uh, make it out of parole, uh, similar to OJ, so it is a possibility. The storage for now is out here. Let me extend the space. And what I think I'm going to do is add a little bit of a room. Is there space over here? Where can I add it? I might just add it out here. Like, I might just make a room. 
And you might find it a little bit unusual, but... I'm not minding it. There we go. Okay, and we're just going to build a little door right there. I know it's out of place, but then I'm going to remove the storage here. And we're going to make it interior storage and extend it if we need to. So we'll get that going. How's the fence? Is it done with the fence? They're done with the fence. Awesome. So now we're going to have the bulldozing of these walls. Boom, just like so. And then we're going to continue the foundation. So we're going to get this done. And then we're going to get this done, and this done, and then add ourselves a little door. A little door for the staff to come in. There we go. Okay. So, oh, 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 we have a problem. We have a problem. All right, what did these guys do? Did they attack a prisoner? Of course they did. They attacked the staff as well. Oh, geez, we have a death. Serving four years, violent disorder, Duncan Wood has died in our prison, unfortunately, guys and gals. Oh, that's a sh- All right, guys and gals, there he is, Duncan in the morgue, so they're gonna remove him once that is applicable when we have the proper transportation services and there we go the guard is wheeling him out probably going to be taking him in something else oh let me make sure the prisoners are coming in okay well, yeah we're filling to capacity now and should be going out there we go there's the ambulance in case you didn't know how they take him out they pull, there we go he's gonna go in the ambulance uh he still has the handcuffs on him in case he wants to escape i guess even though he's dead that's what happens a little bit of blood here. The gardeners will hopefully fix that up. And then these guys will definitely get their time in solitary. So they're going to get just three hours in solitary. We got to fix that. We got to definitely fix that. Okay. Let's add some walls over here. I'm going to be adding a little bit of walls. Well, let's do this. Let's do boom, boom. And just like so. There we go. Okay. And then we're going to demolish, 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 and dismantle. We're going to come over here and work on this area, the kitchen and the hallway. So let's make a little bit of a space here. And there, and I think I'm going to make a door over here. Oh, no, not in the common room. So we'll just do it like this. We're going to make a staff door. I guess we can make a staff door here. Another one here. And then we're going to designate this the canteen. So we are just ginormating and making a huge canteen, just like so. And then we're going to set a kitchen as well. Okay, I. And we're going to wire all this stuff up. That's probably the hardest part. So let's get some electricity in this place. Let's do this just like so. I'm going to line this wall with power. Oh, why don't I just do all the walls? Why not? And then there okay so that would be perfect and then we're gonna start setting all the utilities and I'm not worried that I'm buying more to be honest with you I'm gonna set two of these we're gonna get a sink going just like that we're gonna get a couple fridges I think we'll get two and that's it we'll get a bin for trashy stuff get it trashy okay and then, uh, that's about it. We do need some water though, so I can't forget that. So let's go back to the utilities, water piping. And where's the water needed? Here, right? Okay, hopefully that should work. I don't know if, I don't know if that's overkill or not, but we'll make it work. Now, serving table benches. Let's get all that stuff done. We're gonna do, make the tables this way. I think the serving table, um, We'll come over here. Perfect spot for it. There we go. So there's enough space for all these guys. We're going to start with a table here. Should I put a table on the end like that? Why not? So we're going to get a couple benches. There we go. That's gorgeous. A couple more tables. I think we're going to fill this place up. Should I did in there? We'll do that. We'll go here and here. There we go. And don't forget the benches, because then they need a place to sit. So can't forget that. Oh no! Nope. If you place it, just uh, misplace it. Just right click, and it'll fix it for you. No 
problem. I could probably place another one here, but I think we're good for now. Not too worried. And then we gotta undesignate everything. So what happened to this wall? This wall needs to be built. And now here's the best part. Um, oh, yeah, keep dismantling that, buddy. And then this, I guess we're gonna make it a staff room. We can also make it something else. Let's let's start with planning. Let's see what we can do. Because we could do something like that. That would be kind of dinky, wouldn't it? Let's see. Does that work as a staff room? Here's what you can do. Just go like that. 4x4. Four four. That works, guys and gals. That definitely works. Perfect. Look at that. So we need a white sofa and a drink machine. So let's do this drink machine let's do two of them so they don't fight wide sofa we're gonna give them a TV as well I mean these guys are working hard in our prison so why not give them all that they need we're gonna maybe give them a small sofa and then add a phone so they can call their girlfriends or boyfriends whatever they want to do we're gonna add, uh, add a radio I guess is radio still a thing Let's see, TV. So let's stick one TV over here. Another one right there. And I think that's pretty good. Oh, there's a large TV, isn't there? Ooh, that's lovely. That is spectacularly lovely. Okay, let's do that and take that TV away. That is awesome. So they're going to fight for the big TV. And let's give them a staff door. And that's awesome. Now here, we're going to decide what to do. We might even remove this wall. Well, no, we need that, right? So we're going to think about what rooms we can do. Let's do a shakedown while that's happening. Because we could do dormitories. What else can we do? Forestry. Exports. Oh, a chapel. Is that going to work for the chapel? That is not going to work for that chapel. Six by six. No way. Jose, now a library. We do a mail room. We can also do parole. I think we're going to do a mail room. Let's do that. Yep, I know it's weird. I know the shape is weird, but that makes it kind of interesting, in my opinion. Although that won't work. No 5x5 five five work. A shop. 4x4. Four four. Let's do a shop. Let's do that. Okay, so we need a table, top shelf, and adjacent something. So adjacent... Wait, what's that called? Adjacent to room, shop front. Oh, yeah. Okay, so let's do a shop front. Shop front. There we go. So you need one here, right? Is that correct? Yeah, so we need one here. And why not place one right over here as well? So we're gonna place two of those. We're gonna need some tables and shop shelves. I saw it, where is it? There we go, I saw you. Okay, so let's place some shelves along the side here. There we go. And then some tables just along the sides. And then they can do whatever they want. We'll assign them some tasks. Is that a little crowded? Let's take away one shelf. No, that's not going to work. See? Let's do that. And then let's add a shelf. Yeah, baby. Okay. Now, I wonder if that's going to work. Okay. Um, wait. Where's, where's the table? The table. Okay. That's good. We'll take that shelf away. What's that? Is that a thing? Sure, okay. It's it's a little weird, but hopefully it'll somehow work. Actually, the shelf doesn't seem so bad, so let's do that. Library shelf right there. That's not horrible. They, they, there's space for them to do what they gotta do. Okay, so let's go and see, guys and gals. That has to be done. This prison labor. There we go. Okay, so you hit logistics. And then you gotta make it a room, so you gotta uh, give it a door. Give it a door. And that's about it. That's gonna be the door. Okay, so that's gonna give them what they need to get. We're also gonna add some utilities. They need electricity in here, so let's make sure they have as much as possible. Let's also replace it. Sometimes you get this concrete door issue when you put doors. And so you're gonna hit logistics. One, two, three, four, four jobs. One, two, three. Three prisoners to a kitchen. One, two, three. And then three prisoners to work on a laundry. Oh, that's what we needed. That should have been a laundry, guys and gals. That should have been a laundry. No, we're gonna make the laundry right here. No problemo, senoritos. The laundry should be a big room, I would say. 
There we go. Perfect. It has an entrance. Stuff is happening. Now, canteen's over here. We're going to unassign this canteen right after they eat. So we're going to look at their schedule here. Let's actually assign this kitchen, guys and gals. Let's do it. So they can start cooking, because then the food won't be ready. Oh, it is. It's already cooking, right? Okay. Perfect. Oh, no, 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 no. We had a fight. Unconscious, unconscious. Look at that. Look at his face, all tattooed and crazy and stuff. All right, so we are going to... We just right-click, hold. Right-click, hold, guys and gals. And we're going to demolish everything. Quick way to do it. Just go dismantle object and you highlight everything. And what will happen? Everything will get put where it needs to go. Oh, it escapes. Wait, what? what is going on? Punish. Lockdown. Solitary. 24 hours. Little snot. How did he get out? Oh, man. So, okay. That makes me think we need something, guys and gals. And that is... They got him. We got him. So, I don't know if we did get that escape. But we're going to add something. You should add this. You really should. So, let's go to... Uh, where is it? Where is it? Gate. I put hate. No. <laughs> Road gate. So we're going to add one here. Now would even say one back here. And so what these are going to do, why not three? And so what these are going to do, um, these need to be used along with fences. So you make a fence and you got to fence the entire prison with this. So you're going to go around. I was actually trying to procrastinate. I was trying not to do this. You don't have to put three gates. I just think three gates work for me. And we can even fence it, but then it'll be a fourth gate. So I think we're good. We'll come back over here. Let's finish this guy up. Let's put a wall here. And then we'll just put exports. And all that stuff is there. So anything exported will come from there and that'll be perfect. What else? We have this over here. There are no prisoners. How do we do that again? Deployment. Is that, is that a thing? So you gotta do staff only. Man, how do you do that left click thing? There are no prisoners. There is a way to do it. Okay, we got this room ready. And I'm excited for this one. This is gonna be an exciting one because we're gonna do the laundry. And I think the laundry is one of the coolest things you can do in this game. Laundry is very cool. Okay. So let's start. We're going to start with the uh, laundry machine. We're going to do one, two, three, four, five, six. That's a lot. We're also going to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Use a lot of baskets, trust me. And we're going to have the ironing boards. And you can put as many or as little of them as you want. I'm going to probably place four and see how it works out with four. And these guys need electricity. But they also need water. So be aware of that. So we're going to... Oh, there we go. We'll get the water up here. Through this as well. And shoot it down. Just like so. There we go. Okay, so we got all that stuff done. we got to give it a wall. And we're going to assign them to the laundry and make that money. Now we're going to come back and see if we can do anything else. Let's do an armory or micromanagement. Let's do micromanagement, guys and gals. Let's also do a bank loan. Can we do expansion too? Yeah, we can do all of those three, which we do need to do. Let's go back and get a couple more grants. Build a classroom. I don't know if we're there yet. Armed dogs. Let's do this one for the cells. We get a little bit of money. Okay, we need the laundry one. Okay, good. Okay, so it seems the canteen is good. It's working. Wow, we did place a door right in front of that, right? That is not the greatest placement. What is what is wrong with me there? Okay, I'm going to dismantle that. And I should have another cooker. Yep, right there. Do I have the electricity? I do. Yeah, that was not placed well. I just noticed that. Yeah, so make sure you do that or be careful with that. We're going to also demolish this wall and, of course, dismantle this. Now, this can be so many things. 
I'm thinking of a chapel. Now, does a chapel have to be that big? Don't think so. So let's take that away. Let's go back to the room, security, laundry, library, forestry. Let's do parole, guys and gals. Um, let's do a rather large parole building and then the chapel right next to it. So we need both of those. I think parole is really essential. Is that what I want to do? Yeah, okay. I wasn't sure. There we go. I think that's perfect sizing for both. We're gonna do, we're actually gonna do parole on this side. I can't believe we don't have parole yet. That gets you money, guys and gals, it really does. And then the chapel we're gonna leave open there. And I don't know, I, I really want these guys to have a lot of space in terms of the chapel and what they're doing. So we're gonna give them altar and prayer mats. Just all around. I don't know if they're facing the correct way, so my apologies if that's incorrect. And then we're also gonna need some pews. So we're gonna place these pews back here, maybe along the sides. So I want a lot of people in here. I do want them to go into the chapel and get stuff done, get stuff figured out, you know? Become holy and get out of this place and really reform themselves. Okay, let's get a staff door. Let's get one door here. Another door here, of course, one for the prisoners, one not for the prisoners. And then we need the visitor's tables. Wow, was that so fast? Good good gracious, guys and gals, that was like fast. Okay, is the laundry done? The laundry's not done. So many things need to be done and nothing is done. We gotta add more cells too, so I think we're gonna go this way. And then we gotta expand the shower. Wow, so much to do. Another idea might be to make a great long shower down here or a shower that spans like this way and just give them there. And then the showers could lead to more cells, if that makes sense. Why didn't they do the walls here? Goodness, we need a few more of these staff guys. There we go, that might have been overkill, let me tell you. We do need prisoners too though, uh, not prisoners, guards. Okay, and let's do a few more things to concrete floor. Why is there no floor here? Tiles and tiles and tiles and this thing should be removed and this thing should be deleted. Oh, so many things guys and gals, so many things. Good, get that stuff done. Get all of this done. Look at that, utilities. I thought this was all done. You need a thing right there and then you need a pipe right there and there and there. See, I don't know why that doesn't happen sometimes. All right, guys and gals, well, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for supporting Prison Architect and the fun things that I do in this game. Ooh, this is cool. You can do a hallway and then do the other. Oh, no. Oh, no. We have a problem. I was going to leave, and then we have this. So let's add uh, whew, two more capacitors. Really get uh, that going because these things are super important. Super important. But I like this. Look, these things are already full, ready to export. You can actually sell them and that gets you some money as well as gets things moving so look at that hundred for each of these guys look at that okay so now it's gonna be so much harder for these guys to escape i mean they're working on lots of fencing so i'm not too worried about it oh no 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 and switch on there we go we got it guys and gals and with electricity to spare and we did the thingy we finish one of these grants again, guys and gals. See you next time, and don't forget, be hopeful.